I suppose plants do need watering after all. Oh, I know. You should go help Haru. I'll let the others know. <sighs> How troubling. Oh, have you come up here to assist me? You, um, heard that, didn't you? <laughs> How embarrassing. I'm not worried about the garden, in case you were wondering. It's just... so much has happened to me lately. <sighs> well, perhaps I could share this with you. I mean, it would be nice to have someone who is aware of my current situation in life. The source of my worries is my father's company. Dealing with the aftermath has been difficult. Given how unexpected the accident was, my father didn't have a will. All of his stocks transferred to me. Which means suddenly, I'm the biggest shareholder in a company of over 1,000 employees. But I don't know the first thing about business direction or fund management. Yes, it is quite hard to fathom. I may be the president's daughter, but I never anticipated I'd end up involved in company matters. Because of that, lately I've been meeting with all the various officers and lawyers my father employed. They've been giving me advice on all the things I'm not entirely sure about. Assets, stocks... It's clear some people only want to get on my good side, though. I don't know who I can trust. They try to sound comforting by saying things like, don't worry, or leave it to me. But it feels like they're really only being nice so they can get their hands on my bank account. I... I never realized I could be this distrustful of other people. I'm sorry for ranting on about this matter. I feel as though doing so has helped me calm down a bit, though. The only people I've consulted up to this point have been employees. But I think what I really needed was someone closer to my own age. Closer to my own viewpoint. Hmm. Um, if it isn't too much trouble, could we speak about this again some other time? In return, I'll... Hmm... What can I do to help you? I don't have any unique talents. How about this? You know, gardening. I'm actually quite skilled at it. A few years ago, I even managed to grow a tropical fruit on the balcony at my house. To be honest, this is what I do when I'm alone. To take my mind off of everything that's happened. <sighs> oh, that's right. I stored some vegetables in the refrigerator down in the home economics room. You still have some time, yes? Would you mind waiting here a moment? I grew these right here in these very planters and harvested them myself not too long ago. There's not much consistency to their colors or shapes, but... Vegetables? That's good to know. But to tell the truth, I have a favor to ask of you. I'd like to get Sakura-san's opinion on my vegetables. Do you think I could bring my next harvest over to your cafe? Thank you. I'm sure Sakura-san will give me his honest opinion. I'll make sure this next harvest is particularly good. Well then, shall we head over to the hideout?
Congrats on surviving midterms. <sighs> I think I'm screwed for real this time. I couldn't concentrate at all. Gathering everyone's opinions and immediately acting upon them. In order to make that natural course of action a reality, I will... Uh, again? It's so damn loud! More importantly, what's this you want to talk about? You said that something was on your mind before, but were you able to figure out what it was? The Medjed that I banned wasn't the real one. Huh? Aren't you the real one, though? Oh, uh... The guy who called himself Medjed after me isn't the one from the other day. What do you mean? The code written by that guy the other day is different from any of the past Medjed. And that means... A code is like your fingerprints. No matter how you try to disguise it, your own quirks appear in it. The one from the other day was all cut and pasted with no consistency. No skill at all. But aren't there multiple people across the world that are part of Medjet? Couldn't it have been done by someone that joined recently? How do I put it? That code was so not done by anyone interested in cracking. At all. At the very least, there's no way it was an official Medjed member. So someone used the Medjed name to provoke the Phantom Thieves? For what purpose? Could they have been doing it for fun? It was around the time our group started getting popular, so maybe they wanted in on the hype. Wait a moment. What if it's the other way around? Hmm? Perhaps they use the Medjed name to make the Phantom Thieves known. What? That makes no sense! I actually thought the same as Makoto. Why is that? Know how I just said that code is like fingerprints? I found those same fingerprints somewhere completely different. Where's that? The Phantom Aficionado website. There were traces of it being illegally tampered with from the outside. For real? For summer vacation, the access counter was made to be much higher than the actual number. Same with the rankings. Particularly the time when President Okumura ranked first. So then, the one who provoked the group, and the one who tampered with the site, are the same person? I think I'm starting to see the big picture. Both Medjed's provocation and the tampering of the website brought attention to us as a result. On top of that, our reason for targeting Okumura was influenced by the public and the rankings. The perfect timing and the perfect target. If both of those had been set up... It would all make sense. So the culprit was planning to put the blame on us from the start? No way! This is all hypothetical. We lack any hard evidence. But if all your deductions happen to be correct, that would mean we've been playing right into their hand for the past two months or so. We gotta be overthinking things. I mean, we're talking both the rankings and Medjed. Everyone made a big deal about it. If this was all set up... Then... What kind of guy did we make an enemy of? There's no point in getting anxious over speculation. Regardless, we'll be falsely charged at this rate, and with murder. We must overcome this. But we don't even know who we're up against. Hey, you think we're falling into another trap, even at this very moment? Yeah, this doesn't mean that we've lost yet. Even if this is the actions of a meticulous enemy, we'll just have to get back at them. We need to find clues, no matter what. <laughs>